Kinder Cubs, it's Mrs. Hines again with another math lesson. Remember, math is all about numbers and shapes. Today, we're going to look at our number line again. We have already talked about numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, and we've learned all about those numbers. Today, we're going to learn about the second half of our number line, which includes numbers 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. All right, guys, are you ready? All right. I have cards with our numbers on them. And before we do that, I want us to talk about the fact that 6 to 10 are greater than numbers 0 to 5. So as you go up the number line, the numbers get greater. So our smallest number is zero on our number line, and our greatest number is 10. Less than, greater than. All right, let's look at some picture cards. On my picture cards, I have my 10 frames. You guys are very familiar with 10 frames. So, as you look at this 10 frame, you can see that this 10 frame represents a number. Let's count the dots and see what number it represents. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is what a number six represents. Okay, let's go to the next one. All right, guys, let's count the dots on this 10 frame. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A little bit more. All right, I think you see where we're going with this. Okay, let's count the dots on the next one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dots. Let's try this one. Ooh, we're getting close to a full 10 frame, aren't we guys? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine dots on the 10 frame. And this one's really cool, guys. We have filled up our 10 frame. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yay! All 10 frames are filled with a dot. We have a full 10 frame, don't we? Yeah. All right, let's talk about how we write these numbers now. So I'm just going to write the numbers underneath. I'm gonna start with the six. And a six has a poem that goes with it that says, bend down low to pick up sticks. Now I've made a number six. And then for seven, we say, across the sky, down from heaven. Now I've made a number seven. For number eight, we're gonna say, make an S, close the gate. Now I've made a number eight. For number nine, we say, an oval and a line. Now I've made a number nine. And for 10, we say one egg laid my hen. Now I've made a number 10. Cool. We made six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 today. Wow, guys, I would like for you guys to practice writing number six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 in your remote learning journal today. Okay, guys, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.